What a coincidence running into the cranes up here. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, but this is the place for a romantic getaway. Julian seemed very sweet to Ivy, didn't he? I guess. I'm just glad to see that all the rumors I heard about him having women on the side aren't true. They seem very happy, very much in love. And you know, from the sounds we heard coming from their room, I would have to say they have a very healthy marriage. <laughs> I just can't imagine what all that screaming was about. So blessed. You know, when I was having that dream of you carrying off the naked woman, I had the deepest feeling of loss. It's just, it was a sadness that I knew I would never recover from. Hey, it was a bad dream. That's all it was. I know, Sam. And you're never gonna lose me. Not ever. Absolutely perfect. Completely content. <laughs> oh, I just wish our stay here didn't have to end. Well, I'll just tell the manager that we're going to stay here permanently. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know, that's something the Cranes would do. They could afford to. Mm -hmm. Seems like they can afford just about anything. Mm -hmm. Yeah, maybe that's what makes their marriage so strong. Money? <laughs> no. Just the knowledge that they can spend uninterrupted time. Well, I've never taken you for granted, Grace. Oh, Sam, I know. I mean, just being here, spending time with you, showing me how lucky I am that you're in my life. I mean, we have a wonderful marriage, Grace, but I, I think we should spend more time alone, you know? And I think that we should promise each other that no matter how busy we get, we'll make a point to do this once a year. Just the two of us. What do you say? Grace. Just uh, came by to see if you're okay. I mean, what Julian said about your marriage. Oh, Julian, I don't care about Julian. He means nothing to me. Um, I know things weren't good between you, but I. <laughs> oh, Sam, they are so much worse than you could ever imagine. I should have never left you. I need you so much. I, I should have been stronger. I should have disobeyed my father. I should have walked out on Julian. He's never been a husband to me. If I just would have been stronger, I would still be with the man I love, with the man who loved me. I would still be with you. Ivy. Oh, Julian has no idea that I spent my wedding night making love to you. And he has no idea that you and I were lovers months before he and I got married. And he has no idea that I still love you. Ivy, Ivy, Ivy. Please, Sam. I have 
have spent all these years living a lie, and it has cost me my happiness. But that doesn't matter now. That doesn't matter because you're here. Please, Sam, please make love to me like you did all those years ago. Please. Make love to me, Sam. I want you so much. I can't. I can't. You don't find me attractive. Of course I do. You are a very beautiful woman. But I am married to Grace now. And I love her. What you and I had is over. Look, leave it in the past where it belongs. For both of our sakes. Sam, don't go. Ivy, I, I, I have to. I just came by to make sure that you're okay. Good night. Why did you leave? I'm here now. And I always will be. Mm -hmm.